hi guys we are going to start off right away and yes i'm doing this protective style on freshly washed and conditioned hair first i'm going to part my hair from ear to ear so i can have a front section and a back section we are going to start off in the front so you can clip your back section away and as you guys can see, I'm making a part. You can make a middle part, a side part, whichever part you want. But I feel like this side part makes it look a little bit more elegant and chic. So I already made a section for my first twist. I have a medium size section because I want medium size twist. So do think about it because you have to decide which size you want. So the second step is to properly moisturize your hair because it's going into a protective style for like a long time at least seven days for me at least so you want your hair to be properly moisturized and not dry i'm gonna list all of the products that i use in my description box so go check it out and they will be in the exact order that i use them in so don't worry about it the butter that I used was a mix of shea butter, I think, and coconut oil. I really love it. It's really to seal all that moisture in. Here, I'm just applying some gel to the perimeter of my section just to keep the braid or the twist very neat. And I'm going to try and show you guys how I twist because I can't really explain it. I will make a video on how to flat twist very soon so stay tuned for that. So this is what your twist should look like. Don't twist way too tight because that defeats the purpose of a protective style. I cannot stress this enough guys. It's not a protective style if it's way too tight and it's like hurting you, okay? So don't twist too tight. So you're basically going to repeat the same exact steps that we did for the first twist and please 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 try to make your parting like look neat see mine is like it's okay but it's not okay you know it's like in the middle see it's right in the middle so <laughs> try to make your parting you know a little bit good because it looks a little put together let's say that Starting on the other side, you can make any type of part that you want, but it looks a lot nicer if you part it exactly like the other side. 
yeah if that makes sense you guys know what i mean right and we're going to repeat the same exact step but guys don't forget to moisturize although i'm not showing you guys i am moisturizing my hair very well okay so don't forget that step So this is what the front is looking like. I like it. It looks cute. So let's finish the back part. I took a quick water break because that was a lot of twisting but yeah let's start with the back quick tip for you guys when you're going to part in the back try using two mirrors so you can actually see what's going on back there And this is the final look yes I have a big forehead and yes the back of my head is very flat like I was shocked like I was really shocked but okay it still looks cute and don't forget to sleep with your bonnet or your scarf or whatever you prefer just to you know keep this style juicy and neat okay thank you guys for watching thank you guys so much and see you guys in my next video